Mercedes-Benz was the first manufacturer to introduce a 5-cylinder diesel engine for a passenger car. Afterwards, they developed more of them and other brands followed. The diesel 5-pot is not such a widely used layout, but there is just enough of them to make a single video. As you would expect, every single one sounds beautiful. Alfa Romeo 2.4 JTD Launched as an improved TD engine with a new direct injection system, the 2.4 JTD came out with a Fiat Maria featuring a 10 valve head and 130 horsepower. As the second largest engine of the JTD series, it was kept in production for more than a decade and received a 20 valve setup later on. Italians designed it for Lancia and Alfa Romeo as well, ending its life with a 210 horsepower version. Toyota 1PZ Although it may come as a surprise, yes, Toyota truly made a 5-cylinder engine and it was a diesel. If you are familiar with the 1HZ 6-cylinder unit, this is it with one cylinder chopped off. It's fairly uncommon and only featured in the Toyota Coaster and J70 Land Cruiser. Mercedes OM617 Being Mercedes's most known diesel engine worldwide, it is a living legend. People still love it for its durability and easy maintenance. Naturally aspirated units were incredibly slow, but didn't need a lot of fuel to get you anywhere. On the other hand, turbocharged ones are not fast by any means either, although one can dig a lot of power out of them. Volkswagen 2.5 TDI This engine has started the most incredible story for diesel engine, especially within Europe. With the pump and nozzle injection system, it was the first TDI engine ever created, featured in the Audi 100. This fuel injection technique was used until its very end, even though there was a common rail version made alongside. If you ever spot a 2.5 litre diesel Volvo, there it was as well. VM Motori 531 OHV VM Motori is quite an unknown Italian brand which is dedicated to a diesel engine manufacture for third-party application. Currently owned by Fiat, their engines could be found in many cars by GM, Jeep or even Alfa Romeo. The 5-cylinder was first used as a 2.5-litre in the Alfa Romeo Alfa 6 and then a different straight 5, 3.1 TD in the Jeep Grand Cherokee. Rover TD5 In the middle of the 90s, when Rover was in need of a new engine, Land Rover used the L-Series as a base for the Project Storm, featuring 4, 5 and 6 cylinder layouts. It was finished during BMW ownership, which intended to use their own engines, and the Storm ended up kinda redundant. However, the middle one was produced until a Ford V6 came, making the TD5 the last Land Rover designed and built engine.
Volvo D5. Volvo, as one of the few brands recognized for five-cylinder engines, had a diesel equivalent in its lineup as well. Besides the Audi one, in the beginning of the 21st century, new 2.0-litre and 2.4-litre engines were introduced covering power range from 130 to 215 horsepower. In 2013, the Drive E four-cylinders were shown to the public, replacing the D5 5-pod in almost every model. Mercedes OM602 Succeeding the OM617, the new engine was featured either as a 2.4 or 2.9 litre 5 cylinder. It had a duplex chain to drive the camshaft and fuel pump, and a single row one for the oil pump. It is similarly reliable as the older unit, but the benefit with the OM602 is that it has hydraulic tappets without any manual valve adjustment needed. Deutz F5 L912 As a 5-cylinder version, the 912 series spreads from 3 up to 6 cylinders. The F5 L912 labeling means that it is a high-speed 4-stroke engine, with 5 cylinders being air-cooled as air is translated in German language as Luft. It's been mainly targeted for agriculture machines. Scania DC9 The DC9 was first launched as a Euro 3 complete engine, featuring 8.9 litres of engine volume and 230 horsepower. It could have been found in the Scania K series bus or R series semi truck. In 2008, with a new Euro 5 emission norm, it was enlarged to 9.3 litres, and its most powerful version currently has 380 horsepower and 1600 Nm at 1000 rpm. Mercedes OM612 It is a widely known fact that Mercedes has never built a petrol 5 pod, but has constructed more such diesels than human fingers on a hand. The OM612 was one of the latest generations of the straight 5 diesel engines sold as a 2.7 and 3 litre. The latter one could have been found in the diesel AMG C class. Ford 3.2 TDCI In the United States, marketed as the Power Stroke, the 3.2 TDCI is basically a dual-torque diesel engine as the largest power plant of the series. Except its sound, it has basically nothing extraordinary to say about itself. Although besides Ford, it was also used in the Mazda BT-50 and Viva Rail rolling stock machines in England.
you will never